Powered with a domestically produced engine, the Bayraktar TB-3 unmanned combat aerial vehicle completed its 34th and 35th flight tests, breaking the altitude record of 33,000 feet, its developer company Baycar announced on Thursday. According to a statement from Baycar, the testing process for the Bayraktar TB-3 has continued successfully. After making its first flight for the Turkish Republic's 100th anniversary on October 27, 2023, successfully conducting medium and high-altitude performance tests, the Bayraktar TB-3 completed the high-altitude system performance test and recently reached a record altitude. The UCAV completed the test at the Akinci Flight Training and Test Center in the Korlu District of Northwestern Tekirdag Province with the PD-170 engine developed by Tusas Engine Industries, Inc. Having taken off with PD-170, the new UCAV climbed to the highest altitude that any aircraft has reached to date with an indigenous engine during the test. Accordingly, the Bayraktar TB-3 reached a major milestone in the history of Turkish aviation with its new altitude record. The Bayraktar Akinci Yukav, another original product that Baykar developed indigenously, holds the altitude record in Turkish aviation with 45,118 feet. The Bayraktar TB-3 logged 327 hours and 35 minutes in test flights to date, including a remarkable 32-hour continuous flight covering 5,700 kilometers on December 20, 2023. On March 26 this year, it achieved another milestone by successfully flying with the domestically developed ASELF Lear 500 system, known for its superior performance globally. Equipped with foldable wings, the Bayraktar TB-3 will become the first armed UCAV capable of operating from short runway ships like the TCG Anadolu, the flagship of the Turkish Navy, which was commissioned in the ceremony last year. This advancement, coupled with its beyond line-of-sight communication capability, positions it as a game-changer in reconnaissance, intelligence and attack missions, enhancing Turkey's deterrent capabilities significantly. Selkuk Bayraktar Baykar's chairperson and CTO, previously announced that the company plans to test the Bayraktar TB-3 aboard TCG Anadolu in 2024. Baykar, largely self-funded, has relied on exports for 83% of its revenue since 2003, becoming the defense and aviation sector's export leader, according to the Turkish Exporters' Assembly. Announced as the export champion of the sector by the Presidency of Defense Industries in 2023, Baycar's exports totaled $1.8 billion last year, constituting over 90% of its income and one-third of the sector's total exports in 2023. As the world's largest unmanned aerial vehicle exporter, Baycar has fulfilled 97.5% of its contracts through exports, with agreements signed with 34 countries, including 33 countries for the Bayraktar TB2 UAV and 9 countries so far for the Bayraktar Akinci UCAV. Join Intel Prime Channel membership today and get access to exclusive benefits, including Early access to new videos Exclusive discounts on Intel products Behind the scenes content Live chat with me and other members Other options will be soon available Thank you for your support and for helping Intel Prime grow